sander light installed and launched. And let's refer back to our thread on the duck. So we've already clicked download and buy and downloaded the free Sandra Lite version. After installing Sandra, click on the hardware tab and run the computer overview. Then copy and paste your post here on the duck. We can also see that here. Click on download and buy, download the free version, click on the hardware tab, computer overview. That's very important that we run the correct report. So back in Sandra. We click on the Hardware tab, which is right up here. We could also double click here under Module Type, double click on Hardware. That takes it to the Hardware tab. But it's a little easier just to click the Hardware tab. And let's refer back to our thread. Run the Computer Overview. The Computer Overview, right under Computer Management, we see Computer Overview. We don't need any of these other reports. We don't need any reports from Benchmark or Tools or Software Support or Favorites. We need the Hardware tab, Computer Overview. So we double click on computer overview. Then we see Sandra is running. It's generating our report. And after a few seconds, or maybe a minute or two, depending on your system, your report will show up. This is what your report should look like. If your report is much longer than this report, then you have run the wrong report. Say it's several and several and several pages. In that case, you would close this window and you would come back to Sandra, make sure the hardware tab is chosen, and make sure you've run computer overview. Once you have the correct computer overview report, you can't just click and copy this text. In order to copy this text and post it on the duck, you can use the generic Windows keyboard shortcut of Control C. Control C will copy all this to your clipboard. You can't right click and copy. As you see that makes no difference when I right click. So you'll use Control and C, which is a very basic window shortcut you should know. Or instead of control C, you could come down to this bottom toolbar and right next to the first icon that says options, right here you'll see you'll see an icon that says copy to clipboard and it gives you the generic shortcut of control and C. So we can either click this button once and have it copied to our clipboard or hit control C. To verify that this has been copied to our clipboard, we'll come down to our start menu and launch notepad. Once in Notepad, we can right click and hit paste, or we can use another generic Windows keyboard shortcut of Control V. Control V is paste. Another generic keyboard shortcut for Windows you should know is Control A. Control A will select all. And another generic keyboard shortcut you should know is Control X. Control X will cut. So we could hit Control V to paste, and then Control A, and then Control X to cut. Or, if we didn't want to use Control V to paste, we could right click and hit paste. And then here in Notepad, you could look over your report. It's a good idea to take your report, paste it in the Notepad, and save it before you go to the duck and post it on the duck. Just in case some glitch happens or your post doesn't go through. That way you don't have to rerun the report. You have it saved, and you can look at it yourself offline anytime you want. So now that we have our report copied to our clipboard, either through Notepad or right from Sandra by clicking this button or hitting Control C, now it's time to come back to the duck. If you have already started a thread, be sure to go back to that same thread. So we'll just choose a random thread and say this is my thread and I don't have a Sandra. I'd come down and I'd hit post reply. The title is already in there and then I'd right click and hit paste. And then I would submit my reply. This is not my thread so I won't confirm. If this is your first post on the duck for this specific problem, then locate the correct section. We'll say my problem was with Pro Tools LE 8 on Windows. And we will click the correct section. We'll then come down to this button that says New Thread. And we'll give it a very descriptive title. We don't just want to post something like Help, because that's going to be ignored or laughed at. <laughs> we need to post our specific problem. Something like Help PT 8.0.3 gives, you know, this error. And we'll, of course, have the error posted. Then in the message, We'll be sure to post something that's courteous. We must remember that the duck is a user's form. The duck is not an official support form for Avid. If you want official support from Avid, be sure to go to the Avid website, locate the support and services tab. You will then choose the correct section and contact the official support. Although there are times when official support is given on the duck by Avid, do not expect it. This is a user's form first and foremost. 
So we will describe our problem. Describe our problem. After we describe our problem, then we'll list any error codes. Or say we get an error message that says, you're running out of CPU power. We'll list that here. If we're having a problem with a plugin, we'll say, you know, plugin, you know, say strike is giving us a problem. And then we'll list the problem. We'll also spell check. That's very important. Be as specific as possible with your problem. Then be sure to note the version of Pro Tools, the exact version. If you're running 9, be sure to list the exact version of 9. If it's 9, then hit 9.0. If it's 9.0.2, don't just put PT9, put PT9.0.2. Be very specific. If it's a plugin problem, be sure to list the plugin version. If it's Strike, how do I know if it's Strike 1.0 or 1.5? That needs to be listed. 1.5. Be sure to list the interface you're using. If you're using an 003, Make sure you write 003. If your 003 is the controller version, I'd write out, you know, controller version. If it's the rack, I'd write out rack. If you're using the 11 rack, you could use something like 11R or 11 rack. Also list anything else that you think is pertinent to your setup. And you can always refer back to the official Avid Help Us Help You thread to know what you need to post. All this stuff needs to be posted. Make sure you post your Sandra. After you have described your problem in great detail, and you have also described what you've tried to troubleshoot the problem, after all that, then you want to post your Sandra. So we have our Sandra on our clipboard. We click in here somewhere, and we can right-click and choose Paste. We can also just hit Control-V. That would also paste it into our post. Then we come down, and we submit our new thread. You could choose an icon if you want but you don't have to. You could of course preview your post if you wanted, but you'll probably just hit submit new thread. If your thread does not get answered immediately, do not panic. Remember, this is a user's form. This is not an official form. No one is getting paid to offer help to people on the Avid Audio forms. If you have been very specific, more than likely your question will be answered relatively quickly. And try to always be as courteous as possible on the user's form. You're much less likely to get good help if you were to come on the forum and say new thread and just post something like avid sucks you know or PT sucks or I hate avid something like that be descriptive in your title and be courteous so there are some detailed videos on how to post a Sandra on the duck we'll go over the process one more time first we'll open Sandra and you'll probably default to the home tab come to hardware we go to computer overview and double click. That will generate our Sandra report. From there, we can come down to this little icon right next to the options, right here, and we can click once. Copy to clipboard. It has now been copied to our clipboard. Alternatively, we could have pressed Control C. Before you post to the duck, if you'd like to be sure it's been copied to your clipboard, Open up Notepad and you can right click or you can just hit Control V. We'll right click and hit Paste. And that confirms that our report has been copied to our clipboard. From there, we're ready to go to the duck and post our Sandra on the duck.